rest though I don't back down Leave your heart laying on the ground Tell me who who the killer now Tell me who who the killer now Hello my stars and galaxies Welcome back to my channel, The Universe Terror, okay? Now, before we get started, make sure you guys like, comment, share, subscribe, hit that post notification bell so you don't miss an upload when I upload. Today we're doing about Aries, all about the Aries today. Now, make sure you guys, um, what do you call it? Hit me up on Instagram for a personal reading if you want one, um, or email me, but make sure you put The Universe Terror in the subject line. Um, what do you call it? Um, personal readings are anywhere between 20 and 30 minutes. It's $40 on Cash App and $45 on PayPal, okay? And then one question readings are also available on my channel, right? Um, it's $10 on Cash App and $12 on PayPal. Just so you guys know that now. So, you know, whatever you guys want to do, I'm here for you, okay? So, um, membership is also available on my channel, right? The Starlight Package. Um, the Galaxy Package, and then the Universe Package, okay? $2.99, $4.99, $9 and $9.99 in that order, okay? So, if you want to join my membership, you can. That will be great. So that way we can do member-only live streams and stuff like that. That will be fun. I would actually be really excited to do that with y'all. So, yeah. You know, just, like, hit me up for a personal reading or join my membership. Or, you know what I'm saying? Or if you don't, if you don't want to do either, just donate, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, you know? Just donate. I'd appreciate that. Unless you you are just gonna watch this video and then move on to the next. Like, uh uh, yeah, come on. You know, nothing wrong with a dollar donation, you know what I'm saying? The one dollar. But if you're gonna send one dollar, don't if you're gonna send one dollar, don't um <clears throat> donate via YouTube um thanks button, okay? Because I feel like they're gonna give me like seventy cents out that dollar. <laughs> Oh my god, at least when you send money on PayPal or Cash App, you get the whole dollar, right? Actually, no, not even on, not even, not even on PayPal, really. They take out their little fee, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah. But anyway, Aries, your first card is the Seven of Pentacles in the reverse. Okay. And in the Seven of Pentacles in the reverse, I'm seeing you're having a hard time building a foundation, okay? You're having a hard time trying to figure out what's your next move, how you're going to make ends meet, how you're going to do this, how you're going to do that. It's definitely money-oriented, okay? It's definitely money-oriented. You're having a hard time trying to um, find financial security or stability. And it's, maybe it's not even your fault, okay? Maybe it's not even your fault. It's just how things are going right now. Okay, everything's going up, everything's getting twice the price than usual, and when, when, guess what's not going up? Paychecks. So, maybe you're having a hard time finding a foundation, or maybe you're just having a hard time finding a job in general. You know, maybe you have, a, like, a criminal background, you know what I'm saying, or, you know, you have a disability, and not many people want to hire you, so you're just worried about um, your success in life. You know, but Aries, don't worry, things will work out on its own. Okay. Think, well, okay, well, things will get worse before it gets better, but, because I'm saying that because I see the five of wands now. Okay, in the Five of Wands, there's constant, never-ending conflict, okay? Maybe you're having constant conflict with somebody else, or maybe, or maybe you're having inner turmoil, like maybe you're having con constant conflict within yourself, within your mind, you're always arguing and bickering with yourself, right? Or, um, you know, you just can never really seem to catch a break, you know, you have seeing a lot of anger and um, arguing and sadness and resentment. So there's a lot of, there's a lot of emotions going on in this conflict. Okay, there's a lot of things going on right now. The page of wands in the reverse, okay? You are, you are, um, what do you call it? You have like, um, a creative slump right now. Okay, like you usually like have a plan to try to achieve this or try to achieve that. But right now, you can't figure out anything. Okay, not right now. Right, you're having a hard time. You're having a hard time um, building up for yourself. You're having a hard time. Um, what do you call it? Trying to think of new opportunities, new plans to create for yourself, to make to open doors for yourself. Like you can't really figure anything else out. You're just at a you're just at a you're you're just at a um, a slump. Okay, or you're, you're in a rut right now. Okay, you know you want you want to figure this out, but right now you have you just got so much else, so much other stuff going on right now. It's just difficult to focus on one thing. Like your mind is all over the place. The King of Pentacles, right? So, in the King of Pentacles, as a person, Aries, 
you are um, very um, goal-oriented, okay? That's why you don't like not having a plan, okay? You don't like not having a plan because it's just like, uh-oh. I'm saying, what's the plan? What am I going to do? What's next? You know, da 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 you know? So, you love to, like, create new ideas for yourself. You know what I'm saying? You're very, um, you can't be stubborn, but you also, but you're stubborn for the right reasons. You know what I'm saying? You don't want anyone to come into your, um, situation and tell you what to do, make you make the wrong decisions. Like, at least you have, like, this idea in your head and you know how it's going to happen. You just don't know the blueprints for it yet, okay? But you know, like, the main steps, right? But, like, like in, but you know how to slowly create the blueprints to get to where you want to be, okay? The... Eight of Swords in the reverse, okay? And the Eight of Swords in the reverse, you're trying to let go of your mental struggle, okay? Right? So basically what that means is that, you know, um, maybe you have negative thoughts or you, like, always doubt yourself. You know what I'm saying? You can't really, um, what do you call it? Like, you can't allow yourself to let these dark negative thoughts consume your mind or any intention, even like any homicidal intentions or stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Which can tend to happen. Okay. But that's only like, you know, everyone has a little sprinkle of depression at least once in their life. You know what I'm saying? You know, it's up to them if the depression takes over and stuff like that. But you don't want to let these dark thoughts consume you because you know if you do, you know, you'll, be, you'll become sluggish and miserable and unhappy. Okay? And nothing nothing bad even has to happen to you. That's what depression does. Okay? They just ma it just makes you, like, after you're, like, dealing with traumatic experiences and sad events all your life, you know what I'm saying? It can cause depression, and then depression can make you feel sad for no reason. You know what I'm saying? You can just be sad. You can wake up sad. You know what I'm saying? That's what depression does. That's not even waking up on the wrong side of the bed. That's just what depression does. It makes you sad, like, 65 to 75% of the time. The Page of Swords in the reverse, right? So I'm seeing here somebody is trying to um, steer you away from your goal, Okay, and the page of swords in the reverse. Someone's very conniving. Somebody's very um, um, je like get, they get jealous easy. They're always trying to distract people and get knock people off their goal, right? So that's what they're trying to do with you. So Aries, watch out for people who are trying to be like, oh, you're always working, or you're always doing this, or you're always doing that. You know, you should hang out, blah 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 blah, blah you know, stuff. Just be straight up like, be hey, I can't hang out. I got stuff to do. All right, the Queen of Wands, okay? You handle things with grace. You know exactly how to um, deal with business, deal with financial stuff, you know what I'm saying? Even if things are not going right the way that we want, you want it to right now, at least you have, like, knowledge on how to deal with things. At least you know how to um, pick yourself up when you're down. And that's the good thing, all right, in the Queen of Wands. You know how to pick yourself up when you're down, and you know how to deal with people, Okay. The Knight of Cups, right? You're a strong, responsible person. You don't just mess around. You don't F around. You actually put your um, your foot first. You actually have a good head on your shoulders. Right? Even if you go through ruts and you have a hard time sometimes, that doesn't mean you give up. You still look for um, ways to turn things around. The Two of Pentacles in the reverse, right? And the Two of Pentacles in the reverse, I'm seeing here that there might be problems um arising later in the future maybe you know like you know like just anything could happen okay anything could happen new problems new situations and stuff like that but you know as long as you keep a level head aries you should be able to handle it all well and our last card says the two of wands in the reverse okay you're no longer putting your life on hold for others you're no longer letting people try to tell you what to do you're no longer um like maybe being a pushover or anything like that. Like it's either people want to help you get to where you need to be or they can just take, get their walking papers and stay out of your way, okay? And the two of wands in the reverse, you, um, what do you call it? May feel stuck sometimes, but just know, Aries, that you can always turn things around when things are getting rough, okay? Because you're very creative, you're very determined, and you're very headstrong, okay? So Aries, I hope this did resonate with you. I hope this helped in any way. But if it did not resonate with you, I do apologize. Hopefully the next Aries reading will. In the meantime, though, make sure you guys like, comment, share, subscribe. Hit that post notification bell so you don't miss an upload when I upload, all right? This has been the Universe Tarot. Namaste. Yeah.